to. New secrets about Ryan Gosling's I'm Just Ken performance reveal. The choreographer behind the epic stage spectacle dishes about bringing the ballad to life in a new interview with The Hollywood Reporter. Here's five things you didn't know about Ken's performance on Oscar Sunday. Starting with 62, that's the number of Kens that joined Ryan on stage at the Dolby Theater. The team initially wanted hundreds so that the audience would feel like they were at a full-blown concert. The production team settled for 62, the number of people that would fit on the stage, which we think was the perfect amount of Kennergy. Next up, we have another famous blonde to thank for Sunday's epic moment. But diamonds are a girl's best friend. Marilyn Monroe's 1953 film Gentlemen Prefer Blondes served as inspiration for the musical number. So whose idea was it to bring Ryan's Barbie co-stars and the film's director Greta Gerwig into the mix? Well, that idea came from Ken himself. Choreographer Mandy Moore says the actor told her, quote, I just need to pay respect to these ladies. They are amazing and they're the whole reason I'm here. As for his brief La La Land reunion with Emma Stone, the dance director takes credit for that moment, saying she thought the wink would be a good little Easter egg for Oscars viewers. Emma loved it so much it even caused a wardrobe malfunction. Um, my dress is broken. I think it happened during I'm Just Ken. <laughs> And if you thought Ryan had a lot of time to prepare, think again. He and the team had just a week of rehearsal and one full run-through before going live on Hollywood's biggest night. While he didn't take home an Academy Award, Ryan proved he was the real golden boy at this year's Oscars.